watching Hoop It Up on WSBT 22 with Pete Byrne and Carl Deppenbaugh. Welcome back, everybody. Time to turn our attention north. And uh, one of our favorites, yes. War by the Shore, this time the Hoops Edition. Yeah, and maybe not quite as competitive on the court as, we, as we've seen on the gridiron, yeah, at least. always good. Lancers undefeated in conference play. St. Joe, meanwhile, just 1-4 this year. But you know it's a big game when ESPN <laughs> rolls into town. Nice. Sports well Center, live from the shore. First quarter, great backdoor cut. First shot was blocked, but Logan Steph is there to clean things up ties the game early on. Right back the other way, Samuel Zwabowski. Spin cycle for two. How about that name, Zwabowski? Lancers up by two, and then on the move again, Ruben Conway, a protastic finish. <laughs> this was close the whole way, but Lakeshore does edge their rivals for the sweep, 38-33. Very good game over in the Wolverine Conference. Eddie's looking for the third straight win. They had a pretty nice lead in the fourth quarter, but Berrien Springs coach Mark Haas trying to draw up some late game magic. Shamrocks swing it to Devin Nichols in the near corner. The freshman drives, hits the tough shot there, but Berrien Springs still down by 10. So they try and put the Eddie's on the free throw line to tie it. Doesn't work. Dante Rosano Conley knocks down the free throws in Edwardsburg. Wins again, 61 to 47. That's three in a row. Not too shabby. We ride the roller coaster back to St. Joe, where uh, Sydney Smallbones Lady Lancers two games clear of the Bears for the conference lead. Pick things up in the third quarter. Carly Dubert steps into a three from the top of the key. She had a season high 20 points tonight. Lakeshore up by 10. We go to the fourth quarter. Robin Creeby. Uses a screen, and apparently the bank is open late yeah. on a Friday night up in St. Joe. The deficit back to single digits, but Dubert driving this time to Sarah Dubert, senior to the sophomore, a long two, and a big second half would lead Lakeshore to victory. 60-43, to 43, they sweep the season series as well. Nice when the family members share like exactly. that. Doesn't always work that way. <laughs> Other winners tonight, Michigan, Benton Harbor boys beat Portage Central, while Niles Falls, the Portage Northern, Dwajak, and Brandywine victorious as well. We're going to call another quick timeout, but when we come back, Notre Dame getting ready to play in front of one of the rowdiest atmospheres in college sports. We're talking about Cameron Indoor Stadium, and we'll check in with the Irish and hear about tomorrow's game against Duke right after this.